finally, after a month of preparation, we're finally leaving to Busan. Today's plan, we're gonna head to Hongdae Exit 3 to meet all our friends. I know of three friends that are coming, but there's so many people in the Instagram group, I don't actually know who's gonna turn up, so we'll see. From there, we're gonna head to the charity. They're gonna wave goodbye to us. You all right there, mate? I know, man. <laughs> They're gonna wave goodbye to us. Then we're gonna cycle to the first checkpoint on Yoida Island, get our passport stamped, and then keep going to the checkpoint until we get to Yoju Island, 100 kilometers away. And for breakfast, I'm eating pizza. You ready for the trip, mate? I like, just uh... Yeah, you look ready. <laughs> Looks like you're off to a fashion show. <laughs> <laughs> Got me Paris Hilton inspired sunglasses on. Beautiful, mate. I like your helmet, mate. <laughs> Looks really good. Looks like you got a rugby ball on your head. <laughs> it's because he's off by you. <laughs> Alright, come on, we're gonna be late, mate. We're supposed to meet him at nine. We've made it to exit three. Connor was the first one here. How are you getting on? Very well, mate. We have your passport. Thank you. Passport? Smart, isn't it? So this passport we're gonna take along to every checkpoint, and it's like a red phone booth, and in there we'll get it stamped. And at the end, we're gonna get a medal. Someone else has arrived. Two people, three people are arriving. Like I say, I'm not sure how many people are turning up, but we do have a buddy system. So we're gonna stick to the rules. We're gonna stick to our groups. My group, there's me, Julian, Joe, and Tom. All depart separately, camp separately, and go to the checkpoint separately. So we're gonna stick to the rules and stay safe. So it's gonna be a really good trip. We've come to the Eastern Social Welfare Society building. This is Suyun. Hi. And we're gonna start from here and then head down to the Han River. So we're gonna be camping next to Han River and we're gonna do it in groups of four. So me, <laughs> Joe, my housemate, and my German friend Julian, and my English friend Tom. Really like well prepared. Yeah, we've had a month and I've been saying to everybody, make sure you have everything ready. So people can donate whilst watching this to the charity, there'll be a link in the description. We're doing it for the Eastern Social Welfare Society. So yeah, more people keep turning up, so we're all very ready. Why don't you take a group photo? In front of the building? Okay, yeah, we'll do that. Sausage! Sausages! And we started! Goodbye, everybody! We cycled about nine kilometers. It's been pretty quick to get here. And this is the first checkpoint. All of the checkpoints look like this. It's a red phone box. And we go inside and there's a little ink stamp that you can get on. Press it down on here. And then it's Yoido. Nice. Lovely. Thank you, mate. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not gonna take this shit. Oh, sorry. So this is the first checkpoint of the day. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six checkpoints. On the sixth one is the island that we're gonna camp at. We're gonna keep cycling, enjoy the ride, and we'll catch up with you when we pass Lotte World Tower in Jamsha, which is about 20 kilometers away. <laughs> We've made it to Jamshil. Look at that for a view. The ride down the river was absolutely beautiful, but we run into a problem. Joe's bike is so old, the tire's gonna explode. So we're gonna have to stop off in Tronho because I know a street there that sells bike gear. He's gonna get his bike fixed and then we're gonna carry on out of Seoul and then head right and go down the south to the next river. The first river that we're cycling on now is Han River. 
But then when we leave Seoul, we go on to another river. Not sure of the name, I'll let you know later. But we have hit luck because the past two days have been kissing it down. But today, the weather is phenomenal. Good times. Let's go. So you can see here how frequent we have to stop. This one was six kilometers. This is only four. This is 20. This is 16. This is 14. This is 10. But then when we get out of Seoul in the countryside, they become a lot more like this is 17, 19, 35, 36, 23, 38. So it's going to become a lot easier. We don't have to stop as frequently when we get out of Seoul. So a little update on the trip. We've stopped off at the bike shop. Joe's getting his tires replaced. However, he's on the phone to work because they're asking him to go back because he hasn't finished his projects. So he's down there, pacing up and down on the phone, seeing if he can stay on the bike trip with us. Poor lad. Now he's about to finish the call. We're going to see what he can say. Is he going to stay on the trip with us? Or does he have to go to work? Yeah, it's yeah. a moment of truth. All right. Aye, aye. Aye, aye. Means yes, yes. Aye, aye. All right, hit us, lad. You come in. Or are you going? I'm going. You going? Hey! Oi, hey, 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 hey. Do a celebration dance. No, I'm not going. <laughs> what do you mean? He said he's going. He's, he's like, going to work. I can, I can stay till I've got till Thursday. Hoi, 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 hoi. Do a little celebration dance, lad. Go on. Hoi, twerk, twerk, twerk. Hoi, hoi. <laughs> we've come to the edge of Seoul. We went under a sign that said Hanam Shi. Yeah, so yeah. we've come to Hanam when City. And you can see it. there the buildings on the other side just stop. And then it's just mountains. Today is the best day to be riding. I can't get over the weather. Yeah, it's perfect. And now we're just going to head there, past the river, through the valley. And I'm listening to some fantastic music. Here we come, Boobisan! We've just got to the next checkpoint, it's Nungne Station. And then from here it's 20 kilometers to the next one and there we're going to go have lunch because we're doing it pretty quickly it's half one we left at 10 and we've already done 50 kilometers so if we get to yoju for another 50 kilometers then it could be about 5 pm but then if we factor in lunch maybe it'll be about six or seven so i don't know we're going to stick to the plan and then when we get to yoju if we're feeling ambitious we're going to keep going but either way great I highly recommend if you come to Korea, you got to do this. No, Joe, Joe, you having a good time, Joe? Nah. Uh, <laughs> fantastic time, mate. Absolutely brilliant. Explain, explain this trip in two adjectives. Which one's the? Do you know what an adjective is, mate? <laughs> a describing word. Describe Big. It. Big. Okay. Um. It's fun and adjective. Yes, yeah. fun. Big and fun. <laughs> <laughs> thanks for your input, Joe. Yeah, thanks for that. I'm gonna make you even proud watching this video. <laughs> How was the trip? Big and fun. <laughs> I can see he's getting lost on the way back. <sighs> Look at this man. We've been cycling for about two hours. Not too long. Three, three hours. Three hours? We've made it pretty far. What was the highlight of that cycling for you? Probably the uh, the road next to the river mm. when we're like speeding up, put the headphones in, yeah. listen to music. That was so nice. That yeah. was like just as we got out of Seoul, the city ended and it was just green mountains and it, the river got so wide and the water looked a lot cleaner. And then after that, I enjoyed speeding through those tunnels oh, yeah. because it was nice and cool through there. And that really old bridge with the old metal as well because mm -hmm. that was just going over the river we had great views that was really that was a nice little journey like leaving seoul mm -hmm. we cycled 72 kilometers yes to yangpyeong and we stopped we had some lunch i had some duenjang jjigae do you have the same yes it was really delicious the oh, old lady the emo she was very kind we had some good banchan, some good side dishes. We had some makgeolli. We're way faster than we expected. Mm. We're speeding a, a lot. So now we're just sat outside of GS25. I'm having a Hershey's ice cream. And we only have 28 kilometers to go. And then we're gonna camp on the island. And Joe's here drinking beer on a bike trip. Go on, laddie. Beautiful. 
What time do you think we'll get to? The Maybe 7.30. But sunset is at 7.20. Oh, then we should hurry up. Yeah. Let's try to get to the island for 7 and then we've got time to set up our camp. We'll catch up with you when we get to Yoju Island. To, even if that's another half hour for... I just want to tell you something, we've been cycling all day long and I've said to everybody, oh we're going to go to this island, we can camp there. We've got here now and we've realised that it's a military base and we're not allowed to get on it. And the next island's like 30 more kilometres away. Here's the military people. We've got to take on the 20k I guess. So we got to go another 20k? Oh lads. <laughs> Sorry guys, I got the wrong island. This is going tits up. fucking chucks it out by now. <laughs> Oh, what should we, oh, so we can't go to that island? It's definitely a military <laughs> island. Yeah. Right, Obviously. okay. Are we going to cycle another 20k? Oh, boys. Wait a minute, aren't the rest of them ones ahead? Yeah, where's everyone else? Yeah. They're behind I think, us. Everyone's behind us. Oh, they're behind us. I thought oh, they'd gone ahead because I had a lecture. You can see the military guys going yeah, exactly, over the bridge yeah. there. I wonder what's on that island. Maybe I shouldn't be filming it. <laughs> I was about to say, probably not that far. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go find somewhere with a piano drum and then just pick up a campsite near Why that. Why don't you just sit outside a piano drum? <laughs> <laughs> Should we just go drink beer outside the Johnny job? Why did we leave Seoul? <laughs> so the positive thing is we're going to get a stamp and then after that we'll figure out what we're going to do and where we're going to sleep. Yeah. Connie, you having a good time lad? Having a great time lad. Brilliant. So we went to one park but there was nowhere good to camp so now we're heading further down to Yoju to where the island we actually meant to go to. We're going to try to find a campsite and then after that we're going to go get some beverages. Dan tried to set us up on a... Yeah, a hidden military side <laughs> on a leg of a rocket base or something. And now here we are in the middle of nowhere. We finally made it to a campsite. We were trying to get to the island, but it's another 10 kilometers. We're all way too knackered, so we've decided to pitch up here. One site cost man or chong won 15,000 won, so we're just going to split it between four people. And the good thing about this place, there's a convenience store really close, so we can buy some ramen, some beers. And another good thing, we've actually gone further than we originally wanted to go today. Well, I think we've done about 115 kilometers, which is a benefit. And another benefit, looking on the positive side, we're under the trees because tomorrow is 100% torrential rain. So when we wake up, we can load our bikes, no problem, and not get wet. Joe, you happy, mate? I'm crazy, man. Very happy, mate. How are you, man? I want to get a So we're going to go and get some Desperados, a little bit of Mandu, hopefully. And also, because we're going to be in three separate groups over here, we might make some noise. So we're going to head down here later on and have some drinks by the river. And now Julian and Joe are sharing a tent together because they're cheap skates and they couldn't buy one separately. Yeah, I think one of us is going to end up murdered by the morning. <laughs> See, I've, I've got my own private luxury living. So now I'm going to set this up and then go get some beers. All right, great, terrible news actually. I don't know why I said great, terrible news. I've unpacked my tent and all the poles are disconnected because the string has come out. So now I don't have a tent. This is my current situation. <laughs> It's actually pretty ridiculous. This should be connected by a string like this here, but as you can see, it's all disconnected because it's broken. One of the poles is connected in the tent, but these ones aren't. However, we've come up with an ingenious plan. No. <laughs> so it's the UFO, mate. <laughs> 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 All right, so we're gonna tape the poles together and then I mean, this flush is it through. With the pure string in it, man. You're gonna have to get some pure stuff. Like, okay. I'm gonna have to put subtitles on everything he said just then. <laughs> Making the best of a bad situation. We're gonna get the tape on, and then hopefully this will be erected very soon. Julian, the reason I need the tape. Have you seen my tent? <laughs> Where's your tent? <laughs> <laughs> Look, this is my tent here. Which one? But this on the floor, mate, is broken. <laughs> <laughs> it did cost me two quid at a car boot. Yeah. All right, finally, it's up. The tape has worked. I've got somewhere to sleep. We taped it up all together, mate. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. So about every day, I'm just gonna have to cut the tape and then tape it every day. That could be worse then. But yeah, at least I got somewhere to sleep. Under a tree because it's gonna rain. That's how to build a tent without a tent. In five minutes. Yeah. 
Oh, that's great, boys. Oh. So that's the end of the video. This is the end of day one. We're very tired. We've cycled like how long have we done? Five hours, mm -hmm. 107 kilometers. Mm -hmm. Nice. I started a bit late, so it was maybe three more. Mm -hmm. And a pace of 22.58. That's very 110. fast. 110 kilometers. 110, yeah. So we've done 110 kilometers today. It's been an impressive day. Unfortunately, Joe's going to leave tomorrow. Uh, I'm sick years already. <laughs> Remember, we're doing this to the Eastern Social Welfare Society. There'll be a link to the GoFundMe in the description. So if you want to donate, it's going to end when we finish this trip. All right, let's go get some beers. Yes, mate. Yeah, exactly. Some beers. Right. See you tomorrow. Yo. Joshi man, I'm head of Dan and Kuji. Like book and sign now. Wah. Mori also been a re. Unun sang dong e. Yen and Jordan e. G. Kimchi, Kamjatang, yes, I eat.